What's going on everyone? Justin here with Trading Cards and More back with another box opening video and a much anticipated video today. We have 1991-92 Hoops Series 1 basketball boxes here. Now I initially ordered a regular hobby box uh, with 36 packs and it has 36 packs, 15 cards per pack and uh, I actually wrote down how many cards total so I didn't have to do the math. 540 cards. I picked these boxes up for about mm, 20, 25 bucks a box pretty much uh, and then I ordered some rack boxes because there was a seller that had two box lots of rack boxes that they were auctioning. I actually ended up winning four of these. Uh, we're just going to be doing one of each today. Um, but you can already see, you know, one of the Michael Jordan cards there on the side. I looked into these. I think there's more Jordan cards in Series 2. So I'm in the process of ordering some of them. Those, I think, are a little bit harder, that, harder to find and a little bit more money than these boxes are. Uh, but today we're going to be doing Series 1. Now this has 12 rack packs with 47 cards per rack pack. So, um, and you can see you got Pippin and Rodman on the front there. Very cool, iconic. Um... Pit, uh, Rodman, of course, was on the Bad Boy Pistons, and he slammed Pippen down pretty hard. And uh, when Rodman got onto the Bulls, um, they asked him to apologize to Pippen. Uh, no hard feelings there. Uh, that's why they were called the Bad Boy Pistons. Uh, but some pretty iconic cards in here. I'm pretty excited. Going to be adding these um, cards to my collection, the Michael Jordan cards at least. So without further ado, let's get into it. And I forgot to grab my scissors because I know the rack packs. Uh, we're going to have to cut into them, so I will be right back. All right, we got scissors. So we're actually going to do the hobby box first. So I'm going to set the rack box here off to the side. We still have 8990 hoops. We'll probably do that possibly tomorrow. And then uh, we also have 9192 Skybox Series 2. And I'm just working on getting all these different uh, boxes from, you know, the late 80s, early 90s. I got 90, uh, I think, yeah, I got a box of 1990 Fleer on the way. That one was uh, a box that was definitely going up in price. Uh, my Ops Net is here. What's going on? Yeah, as these boxes kind of continue to go up, since these Jordan cards that are in here um, have just been going up like crazy, uh, they might have, like, kind of flattened out a little bit. Uh, but the, some of the cards, you know, you look at a PSA 10 and maybe it was selling for $25, $30 a couple months back and now it's selling for like $70 to $100 or whatever. So naturally that's going to cause the prices of the boxes to be more in demand and harder for me to get a hold of them at a good price. So I like these packs. They got the nice um, plastic on there. I'm not sure how many Jordans are in this uh, series, like I said. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to put together Michael Jordan cards um, at the moment. I don't really collect certain teams. There's Muggsy Bogues, which we know sometimes it had his actual name on the card. Bill Cartwright, John Williams, Dennis Rodman, guarding Pippen right there on the front of the box. That's a cool card. Uh, behind that, we got Reggie Miller. Very nice. Glenn Rice. So you can already see there's some really good names in here, guys. And like I said, I got these boxes. There's Kevin McHale. I believe he's in the Hall of Fame. There's a Denver Nuggets like team card. That's kind of weird looking. They're all like in an office. And a Clyde Drexler. So three or four, you know, pretty good cards in that pack. That was nice. And looking at the back of the cards, yeah, that card's 262. So I think if the cards, uh, there's 280. I think there's 590 cards or something like that in this in this set. So I don't think I think there's a lot more Jordans in the series too. But there was also like some some insert cards and stuff, I believe, or somewhat kind of like insert cards. And I'm not sure if those are in this series or series two or what. There we go. We got our first Jordan card. Check it out, guys. Nice. That is a good one. Let me get it in the sleeve here. That is the All Star. Right there, Michael Jordan. Very nice card. Card 253. Very, very nice. So happy to get one of those. Does have a, just a tiny little line right there by his arm. Um, factory line, but yep. Pack Fresh Michael Jordan card, our first one of the video. I will take it. Nice. Utah Jazz, David Robinson, Dennis Rodman. That's a cool one. 
jamming. Oh man, this is so early '90s. We got Will Smith right there, jamming out with the with the set, uh, the hat kicked to the side. Oh man, I remember uh, I had a friend that was into um, his music, um, Will Smith, and then was it Will Smith and Jazzy Jeff or something like that? I, I, this was like early '90s. All right, let's get some more packs open here. I, I, there is another Jordan here, I know. Uh, not just that one Jordan All-Star card, but there is another one. And then he might have a league, uh, league Leaders card as well with him and Carl Malone. I'm not sure if that's in this set or Series 2. So we'll just have to figure it out as we go. I'm still learning this stuff. Like I said, um, it's all for fun here. And these boxes are super, super cheap and affordable. All right, see if we get another Jordan here. There's Golden State Warriors card, and we got another Jordan card. Man, not even like 20% into this box, and we're already killing it with two Jordan cards. It's looking pretty darn good, pretty darn crisp. Maybe a t tad bit off-centered, but not by much. And, ooh, it's got a little something in the back. A little blemish there. So, nice, our second Jordan. Same card. And we got another David Robinson, Dennis Rodman. So you're seeing we're already getting doubles here. Uh, like I always say, the quality control. There's a James Worthy, Hall of Famer. The quality control on these, these older packs just wasn't as good. There's that same Will Smith card. Um, Buck Williams, Robert Parrish, Hall of Famer. Sean Kemp, not a Hall of Famer, but a great player. BJ Armstrong. I think that was this would be his second year card. We have pulled a couple of his rookie cards. We got a Larry Bird card there. I think this was like his last season. And we got another card with Jordan on it. It's the Bulls card. Um, we got what Horace Grant, Bill Cartwright, John Paxson, Scotty Pippen, Jordan, and I'm not sure who that is. If that's Stacy King or who that is, but still kind of considered a jordan card i mean it's the chicago bulls team card um with jordan on it so i guess if you want to consider that a jordan card that's kind of up to you Let's see did we put that yeah we did do that upside down i never know if the card's supposed to go this way or it's supposed to go that way but when you look at the numbers on the back and this one it's got a pretty small border over here so i'm guessing that one's kind of off-centered so far, so good. Two Jordans and one Bulls team card. So like I said, we're kind of going to see uh, if the rack box is better than the hobby box. Um, obviously, we're only doing one box of each, so it's kind of hard to compare apples to apples just with one box of each. But we do have more rack boxes. We're going to be opening those in a future video, like I said. Uh, I just want to do you know one of each today since I kind of you know had the, had the hobby box already ordered and then I got... I bought into the um, rack boxes because they were so cheap. There's another Michael Adams. So we're saying, yep, Dan. We're seeing a lot of the same guys here. John Stockton, Magic Johnson. Ooh, I thought that was a Jordan for a second. It's a Carl Malone. Very nice. Pat Riley, good coach. Moses Malone, Hall of Famer. Hopefully that other Jordan's in here where it's uh, Jordan and Malone on the same card. There's Isaiah Thomas. There's Clyde Drexler. Johnny Dawkins with Maxon Garden in there. Reggie Miller card. Hershey Hawkins. These cards are going to flip around. No, they're not. Minnesota. Uh, there's a John Stockton. Another John Stockton card. Charles Barkley. Very nice. He was a little bit more slim and slender at that time. Chris Mullins. We've got a Magic Johnson card. Milestones. It's a pretty cool looking card. Patrick Ewing. Phoenix Sun card. There's a Hakeem Olajuwon. I think that's our first Olajuwon card. Michael Jordan. We got the base Michael Jordan card. Looks to be left to right off centered, and it looks like there's like a lot of little specks. Almost like there was paper loss, but it's. I think it was just the printing. Other than that, it looks good. Um, card number 30. And it's definitely shifted on the left to right, centering, and then the the, bl the black background just got left. A lot of little like white dots on it, almost like a print defect. Um, so probably not going to be the best when we pull that card. So I'm sure we're going to pull a lot more of these though. That being our first one of that card, but our third Jordan card. Dominique Wilkins, Patrick Ewing, and then you got the the cards here that tell you all the different players here. Um, 
the team cards and the different players. Not gonna look at that too long. Another Hakeem Olajuwon, that one with David Robinson. Maybe we did get that card earlier on. Um, but it was definitely our first Olajuwon card by himself there in the last pack. Slyone is in here, what's going on? I was really looking forward to this opening and uh, we ended up doing some other boxes the other day, but like I said, I still have uh, 89 hoops and then 91, 92 Skybox Series 2, which we haven't done the, done those yet, so those will be st starting tomorrow. I know the Skybox Series 2 has a bunch of uh, Jordan cards in it as well. Really nice cards. These kind of remind me of the Skybox 90, uh, 91, 92 with just the really nice crisp cards. Pack fresh. There we go. We got another Jordan card. This is a different one. Yeah, this is a different one. This is a Milestones card. So apparently there's three Jordans out of here at least. This one actually looks pretty good. This bottom corner might be a little bit kind of pushed. Yeah, it is on the back. I can see it. So unfortunate about that one, but... Nice Jordan nonetheless, and our fourth Jordan. That's card number 317. So I wasn't sure if uh, Series 1 went into that card, if it, if it was only like 290 cards in this Series 1 or not. There's Magic Johnson, Gary Payton, Hall of Famer, Mark McGuire. Yeah, but there's definitely, uh, on Series 2, there's definitely more Jordan cards. There's a Phil Jackson coach card, Larry Bird. John Stockton, Mitch Richmond, Hall of Famer. I just uh, bought a John Stockton rookie card. I think I got two of them on the way. You can get those for pretty cheap. The one looked really, really mint, so it's got a chance at a 10, I think. Um, so that would be worth quite a bit of money. I think the 10 is going for at least $500. Sean Elliott, Jeff Malone, Reggie Miller. Very nice. Magic Johnson. Miami Heat, Robert Parrish, Hall of Famer. So not bad. We got a few more packs here for the halfway point of box number one. Then we're going to get into that rack box, which has more cards in it than this box. Um, and I was able to get those for pretty cheap, so I bought them up. And you can get a deal on any of these old boxes. Uh, you got got to kind of get them as they come. Lamar Jackson's in here. What's going on? For the people, James, welcome to the welcome to the video. So we're not even halfway done with box one, and we got four Michael Jordan cards, and then also a Chicago Bulls card with Jordan on it. So that's why I love these old '90s, early '90s and stuff, um, because they had so many Jordan cards in them. So you really get a good bang for your buck. There's Vladi Divac, Kevin McHale, David Robinson. Maurice Cheeks, I don't recall him. Kevin Duckworth. There's the Trailblazers. They were Trailblazers were another Bulls um, team that they went against. That was a big rivalry. Minute Bull. Yeah, a lot of these cards with the the back, the back of the you can see like the little dots in the background. So the printing wasn't the greatest. There's a Robert Parrish, probably 20 years into his career. Ah, uh, there's a David Robinson. That's a cool one. What does that say? Generation 327. Anthony Bonner. Always laughed at his name. Horse Grant. Scotty Pippen. I think that's the first Scotty Pippen that we pulled of that card. There's another Elijah one. 100 Years of Hoops. He's throwing a ball into a little bat bucket there. That's pretty funny. Kevin Johnson was the mayor of Sacramento. Yeah, I think you were saying that in the past. There we go. We got another Jordan card, and it is the Michael Jordan and Carl Malone. Uh, very, very cool. League leaders of scoring, card number 306. So our fourth card with... Our fourth different card with Michael Jordan's name on it. Actually, I think it goes like this. And the way, the way that you know is if you flip the cards around... If I flip this around, oh, not that one. Let's look at the other one. There we go. You flip the card around, you can see the number at the bottom of the card. You flip this one out. Well, just the way the card's going like this, you can see that's how the card's supposed to go. But 
every set it seems to be different. Um, all right, Magic Johnson, very nice. Cliff Robinson, we pulled his rookie cards. John Stockton. And yeah, they still put a lot of coach cards in these in these packs. I don't know if they really do that anymore. Um, so it looks like we're about halfway done with this first box here. I'm going to um, go ahead and open a bunch of these packs up and see if we can get through this box a little bit quicker so we can get onto that rack, rack pack box. Like I said, I'll have more rack pack boxes. Um, we'll open them in some future videos um, just as like kind of a second second box opening type thing because uh, we got quite a few. I kind of want to pull every one of these cards and have multiples. Um, that way I have you know, a good shot of getting a 10 out of all of the cards that I want. All right, let's do about five packs at a time here. Paul Pressey. Carl Malone, very nice. Spud Webb. Bernard King. We can just open them upside down. I can read the names still. Kevin McHale, Vladdy Divac, Hall of Famer. There's David Robinson. Robert Parrish, Buck Williams, Larry Bird. Very nice. A new goal. Ron Harper, Derek Coleman. Kevin Johnson. There's another Chicago Bulls card. Very nice, featuring Jordan on it. And very nice, we'll set that over in the pile. Uh, we got Magic Johnson, John Stockton. Very nice. Horace Grant. Oop. Scotty Pippen, got another Scotty Pippen base card there. That's a nice one, his cards have definitely been going up. Carl Malone. Pat Riley, Moses Malone, Hall of Famer, Reggie Miller, Kim Olajuwon. It's got to be the third one of that card we pulled. Magic Johnson, Cliff Robinson, and there's another Stockton card, and the last card is another Magic Johnson card. So, quite a few Hall of Famers and you know great players uh, in these packs. I know these hoops cards don't have a ton of value, but. Like I said, all the Jordan cards out of here are just going up in value. Um, uh, 2014 tops with I don't 2014 tops. I don't know of uh, tops for basketball. I don't know that there's 24 tops because I know most of the Giannis rookie cards. Um, that's t 2013. Um, I own a few of them, but I didn't know they made a tops. I've never seen a Topps rookie card of him uh, that I recall, but I might be wrong. But I do I do own a couple of Giannis rookie cards, the SP one, um, and I think a couple other different ones I have. But they they all went up up in price, like the Prestige, I think it is. I have that one. I was buying those when they were like thirty bucks, and the price pretty much went to around fifty or more. Patrick Ewing. And so it's it's hard to spend that much money on one card. There's Kim Olajuwon, but basically his cards. I mean, like all these other players, they went up all around the early part of the year, like February, March. So that was around the time I was buying up all those cards. There's Olajuwon, David Robinson. There we got another Jordan card. Nice. Hopefully this doesn't have the same dinged corners the last one did. Kind of, kind of a little bit pushed. But look, pre looks pretty good, and the background looks pretty nice, and centering looks good on it. So I'm happy with that one. So that's our second one of card number 317, Michael Jordan card there. Very nice. James Worthy. Magic Johnson. I'm not familiar with who the Terminator is. Um... Yeah, a box that has Giannis in the set. That would be any any kind of a new basketball. And the problem is a lot of that stuff is pretty expensive. It's like I could buy, I could open a box of these old cards and pull Michael Jordan cards out of it, and the boxes cost less money than you know what you would pay for some, a new set with you know all these new players in it. Which we've opened some of those boxes in the past. It's just right now you just can't find any of that stuff. 
at Walmart or Target or anything. If you go on eBay, you're going to pay two or three times as much money as what the stuff uh, regularly costs. And I just don't feel like spending an arm and a leg to get it. Um, but yeah, we've opened stuff uh, on the channel with, with Giannis in it. Um, we've opened different basketball sets from 2017, 18, 19 and whatnot. Um, but trying to find a box with his like his rookie cards in it, that's going to just cost you an arm and a leg. And like I said, I already have a few of his um, his rookie cards. I'm sending them to uh, PSA, so those will go into my collection. But like I said, they're so they're so hard to get, and there's so much money. Um, it's just it's hard to really want to like put that much money into it. Yeah, Phil Jackson card. Yeah, there is a Phil Jackson card in here. We pulled his uh, 80 or 90 hoops, and then we're going to be pulling his 89 hoops. Um, those would be the only ones that I would probably want to get graded because they're like the first ones. Uh, Sean Kemp. And they do bring, you know, a decent amount of money on, on eBay. Reggie Miller, Carl Malone. B.J. Armstrong. I, I watch movies, but not very often. Not really. And do, I don't really find the time anymore. There's Magic Johnson. Usually I just watch YouTube videos and learn stuff. Dennis Rodman and Scotty Pippen. Oh, so that's a Rodman card. For whatever reason, I was thinking it was a... Scotty Pippen card, but yeah, it's Dennis Rodman's card. He's guarding Scotty Pippen. Very nice card. Uh, that's iconic because that's on the front of the box. There's Reggie Miller again, Glenn Rice. So we keep hitting these same streaks where we get the same cards. There's Magic Johnson. Um, lots of duds here. Looks like this pack is upside down. What happened here? Or is it just a couple cards were upside down? Robert Parrish again, Hall of Famer, another David Robinson card, 100 Years of Hoops card. And we're coming down to the last stack here, and then we're going to bust into the rack box. Um, so we've did we've done pretty good on the Jordan cards. Um, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, basically like six Jordans in this box so far. So let me know uh, which box you think is going to kind of kind of win the battle as far as the Jordan cards go. Um, like I said, the rack boxes have uh, more cards in them, which is kind of cool. Um, and I paid around the same. I think I got, I can't remember exactly what I paid for those rack boxes, but it was probably like between $20 and uh, $25 a box shipped. Scratching Ted, what's going on? Thanks for coming. You didn't miss much. We've, uh, that guy looks goofy. Uh, we've pulled like six Michael Jordan cards so far in this box and there's four different cards that feature Jordan and then if you count the Chicago Bulls card that would be five so quite a few Jordan cards in these old boxes see if we can get another one in these last five packs here and then we're gonna bust into and we got one we got the Michael Jordan Carl Malone card very nice it's a little bit off-centered not seeing much else issue with that Sometimes when they cut them, the blade, you can see like the silvering kind of along the bottom there, but typical with these older boxes as they just printed them into oblivion and the blades eventually they got kind of dull and the cards don't have real sharp edges on all of them. Carl Malone, Spud Webb, so we're hitting that same streak again, John Stockton, um, John Paxson, Joe Dumars, Hall of Famer there, Mookie Blaylock. Boston Celtics card. There's jamming with Will Smith. Stay in school. See that stay in school crap was like such a big deal back then. Stay in school. Tim Hardaway. David Robinson. We got 10 people in here. If you guys don't mind hitting the like button, I do appreciate it. Yeah, be cool. Stay in school. <laughs> it's so cringy if you think about it now. There's a, the same car that jamming with Will Smith. So, man. Okay. Let's go ahead and sleeve this last Jordan up. We'll count them up. Um, show you guys what we got out of this first box here. And we'll see if we can beat it with the other box. So, uh, we got this Michael Jordan card, card 317. We got two of those. Uh, Jordan and Malone card 306. We got two of those. The main one we're going for is this one here, which had the paper loss on it. Or, you know, bad print. Card number 30, we got one of those, and then we got two of the All-Star Weekend one there, card 253. 
So in total, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven Jordans. And then we, of course, got the two Bulls cards, but I don't really count those as being Jordans because it doesn't say Jordan on the card. Um, so let's see if we can get more than seven out of this box here, which does have 564 cards in it. So a little bit more than that last box. Um, these were case fresh, too. I mean, this, this seller had just a ton of these, and I bid on a bunch of them, and I was able to win four of them. But you can see, like, just they're fresh out of the case, brand new. Really, really nice. Um, and you can see that one of the Michael Jordan cards right on the side there. Come to find out, we did not pull this card in the uh, last box. So that is odd. It says Slam Dunk Champion. Um, so I'm not sure which card number that is. Or if that's even in this box and it's just in Series 2, but they put it on the side of the box. I don't know. But we did not pull that um, from the box. So you see they got these nice rack packs and they kind of fold out. And there is uh, it's essentially like three packs in one. So there's 12 packs. Um, but if you multiply that by three, that's 36. The same as a regular hobby box. But the packs are just different. Um, really, really cool though. So we're going to crack into this and see. And like I said, you get more cards in these because you get 47 cards in a pack instead of you know, 45 you would get out of the hobby. Let me just get my scissors here and open these up. I figure this would be a lot easier than... Okay, my scissors aren't too sharp. A lot easier to open than uh, trying to bust into them. Good old rack packs. I don't remember ever like seeing these and, and buying these on the shelf or anything. Just regular hobby box packs. Uh, I think he's saying there's 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 a basketball player that that was their nickname or whatever, but I don't I don't recall. Okay, first rack pack here. Let's see what we get. We got a coach on the back there. Bernard King. We didn't see that one in the last box. Card 322. That's weird. At least I don't recall seeing that card. Some of these cards are a little bit sticking together. Not really sticking together, but just gotta make sure I can see every card. Dominique Wilkins, there's a nice one. Got some cards flipped upside down there. Robert Parrish, Hall of Famer. There's that David Robinson card again. Gary Payton, Hall of Famer. I was gonna watch his induction speech the other day and I just forgot to do that. Got some more stay in school cards there. There's the Celtics with Larry Bird on the front. There's that darn Will Smith card again. David Robinson, Dennis Robin. And we got our Michael Jordan card number 39. Was it 39? It's got a small little dimple in it. Card 30, I apologize. A um, little bit left to right, but the, the actual card stock looks, looks a lot nicer. Um... So yeah, nice card. That would be our first Michael Jordan of the rack box. So we gotta get seven in this box to tie the other box. If we get more than seven, then this box would win. If you guys wanna you know, take your guesses, feel free. There's Patrick Ewing, Dominique Wilkins. But we haven't seen that Jordan yet that's on the side of the rack box, which is quite strange. There's a Larry Nance, because this one says slam dunk. Card number doesn't uh oh this one doesn't have a, okay it says one so slam dunk let me see this rack box here michael jordan slam dunk so maybe you could only get these slam dunk cards um with this blue top part let me see the last box here if we pulled any of those there's dominique wilkins that one we just pulled maybe only in the rack box you can get those slam dunk cards i don't know inside stuff if anybody wants to uh, inform me if you guys are aware but yeah I'm not seeing any of those cards um, in this first box yeah I'm not seeing any of them so what I think was only in these rack boxes you get these cards that say slam dunk on them and they don't have regular numbers on the back they have these Roman numeral numbers so that's cool so we can pull another Jordan that we did not pull out of that last box we can pull it in this box so that's really awesome so I'm glad I bought 
uh, a handful of these rack uh, boxes. So I'll be able to pull multiple multiple of those cards. I don't know if that card's more like valuable or rare. I'll have to like look into it a little bit more. But it being that it's not part of the regular set, because it's got that Roman numeral on it, might have a little bit more value, I'm not sure. Cards are a little hard to slide out of there. Good old rack packs. Yeah, these uh, these boxes are still affordable, so if you guys want to open something fun, definitely go ahead and buy one of these. I I recommend it. All right, first one we got a slam dunk Dominique Wilkins. Yeah, those are completely different. They're all Roman numerals. There's Roman numeral two, so I'm not sure which Roman numeral the Jordan card is, but my guess is we're gonna we're gonna hit one. If not in this box, I'll hit it in one of the other boxes. Oh, there's a David Robinson again. So that is that is cool that those are in here. Because I wasn't sure when I was looking up all these cards on eBay. There's John Stockton to see what they were selling for and what cards we could potentially pull from this box. I was not 100% aware of what what came out of what here. Um. Gary Payton, very nice. Yeah, I don't really hoard the cards. I'm just, I'm trying to get like one of each card for my collection, and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna grade them. And there we go. We got a Jordan Carl Malone, nice. So we got a few of those in the last box. Kind of the pack there. We had Stockton. So that is a nice one, and looks a little bit better left to right centered than the last one was. Yeah, I just want to um, get a PSA 10 of every one of these cards. Because these were like the first, essentially like the first years that, you know, you had Jordan. Jordan's rookie year was 86, 87 Fleer. And then you had 87, 88. That's his second year card. And then you had 88, 89. I have the all-star card. I don't have the base card. Uh, then you have 89, 90. The Fleer um, boxes are pretty expensive. I'm trying to get one, but they're like 300, 400 bucks. Uh, and then you also had hoops in 89. Um, and then... In 90, you had Skybox, Hoops, uh, and Fleer. And so we're trying to do all these different boxes, um, at least starting with 89. Um, I know it's going to be a really hard to get the Fleer, but we've already done uh, the Hoops. Or we're going to be doing the 89 Hoops, I'm sorry. Uh, and, then the, and then the Fleer is, like I said, hard to get. And then all the 90, 90 91, 92, 93... So we're going to be doing all these boxes, hopefully. Uh, that's kind of my plan as of right now. <clears throat> what I generally do with all the all the ones I don't want, if I, I'll just sell them on eBay. So it's, I'm not trying to like own every single one of these cards. Craig Hodges, Sean Kemp, Kevin Gamble, B.J. Armstrong, Magic Johnson. It's just you can get these boxes for so cheap. It's like why would you? Why would you not? There's another Larry Nance. Just can't go wrong. Can't go wrong with that kind of price. Moses Malone. I realize he was a Hall of Famer as well, but Robert Robert Parrish. So two Jordans so far, but we've only done a couple rack packs so far. So I think we're gonna get quite a few more. Let's cross the fingers there. I want to see that slam dunk one though, because that's not in the hobby boxes. All right, might do a might do an earlier live stream tomorrow. I'm not sure, depending on what I got going on. Um, do eBay eBay? You can sell anything, graded, ungraded, collections. I mean, just you name it. So, I have bought graded card lots. I actually bought a bunch of Ken Griffey Jr. cards that were all graded. I got, those are going to be on the way. I bought a bunch of ungraded as well that I'm going to be sending off. Come on, Jordan, where are you at? Where are you hiding here? There's Mark Jackson. Buck Johnson. Kim Olajuwon. Checklist card, James Worthy, 
There we go. We got the Michael Jordan slam dunk card. Yes. Awesome. The Roman numerals on the back. Looks like it's really nicely centered. Really nicely sharp. The bottom might be a little bit. I'm not sure if it's not really a bend. Uh, it's not looking 100% perfect, but um, card number four on the Roman numerals um, for the slam dunk Jordan. Still a pretty sweet card, and like I said, you can only get them out of this rack pack, I guess. I don't know. They weren't in the hobby box, so. David Robinson card. Glad that we could pull that card, though. So it's our third Jordan out of the rack box here so far. All right. Very cool. That's why I open all these um, different boxes so you guys can see, you know, what what you pull out of them, um, what cards you can get, which ones, you know. And then I can go back to these videos in the future if I want to get more and see which ones I did better on so I can decide how much money I want to spend on getting these boxes again. All right, I'm not sure what rack pack we're into. I think if there's 12, I think this is uh, the fifth pack, so we're not even halfway done here. All right. Derek Harper, D. Brown, another slam dunk card, card number six on the Roman numerals. Tim Hardaway, Robert Parrish. That's a uh, yearbook, Robert Parrish. So that's when he was a lot younger there. Class of 76, that's pretty funny. John Paxson. There's John Stockton, Magic Johnson. Thought that was the Jordan, but it is not. It is the Patrick Ewing. We haven't pulled one of these in the uh, Jordan yet out of this out of this box. James Worthy, Pooh Poo Richardson, good old Pooh. Larry Nance, Reggie Miller, Jeff Malone, Magic Johnson, and a Robert Parrish. All right. Just about halfway done with this last box here. So, so far, I mean, we only got three Jordans and we got seven out of the other box, so if we don't hit another one here soon. I don't know that this box is gonna beat it out, but we still have three other rack boxes that I'm gonna be opening in the future. So I'm sure we'll have some boxes that have more than just, you know, the average amount or whatever. Right. Let's see if we got more Jordans here. We got a Dominique Wilkins slam dunk. That's card number two. So we already got that one earlier. And we got a, another Michael Jordan. It's the milestone card. Pretty left to right off centered on that one. Um, but yeah, milestone points, 91 points. Holy cow. The only second player in history to lead the league in the department at least five times. Will Chamber, Chamberlain uh, led the NBA in scoring seven straight years, 60 to 66. Jordan moved ahead of George Iceman Gervin, who led the league four times from 78 to 80. Huh, very nice. So, Michael Jordan, that would be card number four. And we haven't got a double yet of any of the Jordan cards out of this box. We also haven't got the, the Bulls team card out of here yet. So, still a lot of cards to get here. Terry Porter, another Magic Johnson card there. You can tell he's a lot younger there, his rookie year. Isaiah Thomas, Clyde Drexler, Moses Malone, Reggie Miller, Hershey Hawkins. Sean Kemp. B.J. Armstrong, Larry Nance, got that one quite a few times. We got another Phil Jackson card, Joe Dumars, and Larry Bird to finish that one off. So halfway done, we got four Jordans. So yeah, we're actually in the lead on this box. Um, if we can pull another four, we would we would win on the rack box. Just the fact that you have a shot at getting that Jordan slam dunk card um, gives you a better better odds on this on this box. Plus, you're getting the extra cards. 
I think it was like, what was it? This one, let's see, 12, 20, I think it was 24 extra cards in this box as opposed to the hobby, hobby box, so. All right, Spud Web. Ooh, that card got pent up, huh? Another card with a little bend. Jeff Malone, Larry Bird card, Magic Johnson, Patrick Ewing, Hakeem Olajuwon, Charles Barkley, I don't think we've seen too many of that card, Chris Mullins, Brad Daughtry, another Larry Bird team card there. Bill Cartwright, Dennis Rodman again, Reggie Miller, Glenn Rice, James Worthy, Kim Olajuwon, David Robinson. So still at four Jordans. All right. Only thing that sucks about these is cutting into these packs. You have to do just one little area at a time. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll open a couple of these at a time. Go a little faster here. Like I said, we'll be back tomorrow for another box opening, so make sure you're subscribed and have a push bell on if you guys want to watch the video live. It's probably going to be the hoops because I still have, I have a whole stack of 89 hoops basketball that I want to want to get into. Uh oh. Um, yeah, we have an error here, guys. So this middle compartment that's supposed to have all the cards in it has no cards in it. So I think we got a kind of got screwed on this box. Um, that is strange. Yeah, no cards in it. All right, so that was an error. I don't think any of the other ones had that issue, did they? Huh. Maybe, I don't know, that's weird. Not really sure what happened there. Joe Dumars, John Stockton, Magic Johnson, Carl Malone. Michael Jordan, there's the card we want. Card number 30, it's looking pretty good. The cut was just a little cheap on the cut there. Blade was a little dull, but this one's looking better than the last two that we pulled. So very, very nice. Um, do I only collect basketball? I do have some baseball in my collection and I have some Pokemon as well. So that's our fir uh, fourth Jordan out of this box. And we only got one of those out of the first box. So I'm happy about that. Yeah, older Pokemon cards and um, I have some new as well, but I'm probably going to be selling a lot of those off. Slamming with Mike is coming up. Okay. Slamming with Mike, they said. Maybe they seen it when I was opening the packs. Um, yeah, I do baseball. Um, a lot of the players I grew up on, um, there's Reggie Miller. Like, I've been buying into um, the kid, uh, Ken Griffey Jr. There's a John Stockton card. Mookie Blaylock, Larry Bird. There's a, another Bulls team card. Gotten quite a few of them. First one in this box, though. Isaiah Thomas and Clyde Drexler back to back. There's a Larry, Nun uh, Larry Nance slamming card, not a Jordan, though. Jamming with Will Smith. And his cool, clean wraps. <laughs> Charles Barkley. That was funny when they made fun of him. And we do have the Jordan. It was on the back. So somebody uh, saw that. Um, nice. Slion must have noticed it. Very nice card. Um, this looks like it's got a little bit of a, like a scratch type thing going on there. Not sure what happened in the print. And a little ding on the corner. So fortunately not going to grade that one. But that is our second one of this box. And we are at three, four, five, six Jordans. So we're, we're doing really good. One more to tie uh, the other box. I, I mean, we got a, we got screwed out of the cards 
Uh, I think we still got more cards in this than we did the Javi, but we had a section there that had no cards in it, which that is quite strange how that could happen. But that's why I say the quality control on the, these old boxes, it was just not that great. You have a lot of the same cards all in the same order and issues with the printing. and Just all part of the process, I guess. Set these off the side here. But, I mean, we got two Slimely with mics, which was awesome. And we got two base number 30s. And then the other two cards, we got two of them. But we still haven't got the, um, still haven't got this one out of the box yet. So that's strange that we haven't hit that one yet. But maybe it'll be in these last, last three uh, rack packs here. There's another Phil, Phil Jackson to end the video out, so that's going to be nice. All right, we got Dominique Wilkins. Let's get some more Jordans here. Come on. Anthony Bonner, Horace Grant, Larry Bird card, followed by Kevin Johnson, Tim Hardaway. Sam Perkins, Robert Parrish, Reggie Miller, Jeff Malone. There's another slamming with D. We've got that card so many times. My new bowl, D. Brown, Robert Parrish, Reggie Miller, and Jeff Malone again. Magic Johnson again. If you don't like getting the same cards, don't buy into these old boxes, but if you don't mind getting the same card over and over again, back-to-back uh, -back Magic Johnson, anyone? Same card? <laughs> um, that's kind of what I like about them, because then you get the same card, and then, you know, especially if you're going for a PSA 10 or a Sakeem Milaje one. And we got another Jordan card. Nice. Our seventh Jordan card of this box. So we are tied with the other, with the other box. Once again, the same left-to-right off-centered issue on this one. So, being that it's pretty far off-centered, uh, that right off the get-go is not going to have good eye appeal. Um, you can see that border on the right side is real skinny, and the same issue with the other one. Of course, out of the other box, which was part of a different print run, looks completely different. But, we're at seven Jordans, I'm not complaining. Another Dennis Rodman, another Reggie Miller, Glenn Rice. It's like the same order almost every time, too. Joe Dumars, Phil Jackson, Coach Card, Larry Bird. Oh, God, slamming with D again. Ah, geez, Louise. Every time we get the same cards. We got Scotty Pippen again. Akeem Olajuwon. Slamming with D Brown. There's another Magic Johnson with the. Almost looks like he's got an afro going on there. Totally late 70s there. And Phil, Jacks, uh, Phil Jackson card at the end. So we got one more rack pack here. We're tied with the other box, but we did get two of the slamming with Jordans. And out of the last box, we got two of the Jordan All-Stars, which we haven't got a single one of those out of these packs. So I don't know what's going on there. But hopefully we get one out of this last rack pack here. That would be a nice little icing on the cake. Oop, there we go. It looks like we went for about 50 minutes on this video, but I thought it would be fun to have like a little, um, bet, um, uh oh, do you guys see that? Do you guys see that? So that's looking good here. Let's get through this. I thought it'd be fun to have like a little head to head and see which box is better, kind of, kind of a thing. Um, instead of like just opening them or just open them on different days or something. That way we can see right off the bat which one is kind of like, you're going to get more hits out of it, I guess. At least for the Jordan cards. But you get more cards all together, so it's... I think that's worth it, isn't it? See, that card, we haven't gotten the Jordan yet. Patrick Ewing. And I don't know why. That's strange. Jeff Malone. Let's see if we can get it on this last stretch here. Magic Johnson again. That same darn card. Got a Larry Bird coming up here. Got a Hakeem Olajuwon again. James Worthy. 
Larry Bird there. And our last pack, last set of cards here. And it's going to yield us one more Michael Jordan slam dunk card. Ooh, tiny bit left to right, but all the corners are looking nice and sharp. I'm not seeing any issues there. I'll have to look all these over um, after the video here. See which ones I'm going to be grading. So I want to have every all five of these Jordans in a PSA 10 is, is, is my goal, basically. So... Yeah, let's go over the cards, show you guys what we got. Um, so the Slam and Michael, we were able to pull three out of one box, which is pretty sweet. I think that's about a $100 card in a 10, I'm not sure. And then we got two of the Milestone Point ones, two of the base card ones, card number 30, and then one Jordan and Malone. So we were able to pay three, four, five, six, seven. We got eight out of that box. So, and then we did to get one Jor uh, Bulls team card. First box, we got two Bulls team cards. Uh, we did get the Jordan uh, All-Star Weekend card out of the first box. We got two of them. We got one base card, two Jordan Malones, and two of the Milestone ones. So we only got seven on the first box, eight on the second. So we ended up with 15 Jordan cards, and my total spent was like less than 50 bucks. So um, I, I'd say I did pretty good. I don't know. Like, you can't go wrong with these old... Um, these old boxes. Scratch and Ted said, that came out of a sealed box that was probably a manufacturer error and you caught it on live footage. Um, not sure what you meant by the manufacturer error. Um, but yeah, that's going to be it for the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Um, it was a lot of fun. We're definitely going to be doing some more of these boxes in the future. Like I said, I got like three more wet, th three more of these um, rack boxes um, to open, but we'll probably just do it at the end of another video just to kind of extend the video some people like watching the longer videos so yeah did pretty good had fun uh have a good day and we will see you back here tomorrow